Hello my fellow butterflies and my loopy lovies. How are you all today? Today is Friday, June 9th and uh, I come to you with some more test results which I finally did a couple days ago. Went through um, all of this that you see here. All this test results and everything and I highlighted everything that was um, positive or low or um, high you know if if it was supposed to be high then it was low and if it was supposed to be low it was high and then all of my positive results so uh, I know Brenda will help me hi Brenda and I bet um, Tremia will probably help me hi Tremia uh, Juju B would probably help me. Hi, Jules. And uh, Lupus Life and Anna Marie. So I know you guys are real skilled on this. So, um, and also Chandra, if you uh, sign on, you can chime in as well. Okay, I'm going to start with something that's not necessarily, um, well, it isn't related to lupus. But I had my, um, but first of all, I'm in silhouette because. I need the light from the window to come in so I can see the pages. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, I'm just going to be in silhouette today. Okay. So my three-year colonoscopy was done last month, May 17th. And, um, and I do use a magnifying glass. So, And um, they actually found two uh, polyps that they removed this time um, and I had it done three years prior and they removed four polyps which was the first time that I ever had it done and they removed four polyps four or six I always forget but this time last month they re removed two polyps uh, 40 cm and then centimeters I'm, I'm guessing and then 25 centimeters and that was the size of the two that they removed they said they were very small which was good um, but then I happened to call the doctor's office on um, oh what was it I called the doctor's office one day last week to see what the uh, biopsy showed and um, the girl on the phone told me that it was benign. So I was like, yay, you know, but I always, always, always ask them to send me the report in writing just so I can kind of remember when I need to remember. Uh, and if I don't, I can always have that to refer to. And um, so <clears throat> she told me that day that I talked to her that she would mail it out to me, which she did. And here it is. But, oh, it's way, I can't see. I'm not even going to try to show you. But, what it did say, uh, it had two options on it. When it told me the result of your biopsy polyps pathology was um, two polyps. And they were, I'm going to spell it because I can't really, uh, adenomatous matches I'm not sure but it's a d e n o m a t o u s and um, so the other uh, check mark or the other option was hyperplastic which means benign it has it in parentheses and that one is unchecked so I went to the internet and I looked up this word, which I'll try to put at the bottom of the screen. Hopefully I can. Um, but it didn't say that it was benign. So he told me to come back in um, five years. But I had already been told by the first doctor that I needed to do it every three years since my dad died of colon cancer so um, I'm not going to listen to the second doctor um, they removed two and those obviously grew over the last um, what over the last three years 
So I'm not gonna give them an extra two years to grow and, and multiply, no. So I'm going back in three years. Uh, but I have some uh, results that are connected to all the tests I've been going through. So let me get those for you. I have them right here. 